Hello here, it's Lisa State of the YouTube channels Lisa State and Hitler Obsessed coming to you all about the continuation of the life and death of Adolf Hitler. Oh, sorry about that, yeah. Uh, but I was talking about, you know, I was going to continue on with uh, the video uh, about, you know, <laughs> about, you know, the Valkyrie assassination attempt on Adolf Hitler. Uh, many a uh, terrible film has been made that isn't historically accurate. Let's just say that. But eventually, you know, the backstory to that little thing is is that uh, a bunch of Hitler's generals tried several times to reason with Hitler uh, to get him to not start World War II. This is the backstory to what that is. Uh, knowing Hitler, it wasn't really happening. Eventually, they thought, you know, maybe we could capture him. Well, that wouldn't happen because, you know, the Gestapo and the SS and the SD uh, and Hitler's uh, personal SS bodyguard, okay? The next thing would be to try to assassinate him. There were several attempts because there was another guy called, I think, Eisner Rodolfo, who tried blowing up uh, with a bomb hidden in a column in uh, the beer hall where Hitler had the beer hall preach on one day anniversaries. This is where the generals got the idea if a civilian could almost kill Hitler, why not us to save Germany? Many of them were not really like, you know, let's stop the genocide. I hate to say, I hate to bust that bubble on you. So. <coughs> but eventually, you know, you'd have you know, the Valkyrie assassination attempt that would happen in the Wolf's Lail. Uh, nowadays, you can actually visit the place. It's I swear, go you Google that, go watch a video on, see what it looks like today, and you think it's probably not the best interest to try to clean up its reputation of being like a neo Nazi theme land to make it more of a museum. I'm guessing they're doing the best they can. <laughs> they're kind of a bunch of people that are trying to support the local area, so I guess that's good. A small, I guess museum or whatever trying to support a good cause. The same. Uh, but eventually, you know, uh, back to the same. The, so Count Von Schaff and a bunch of generals tried to actually start a pooch, which was a revolution coup d'etat. But after trying to kill Hitler, I'm not going to give spoilers because there's so many movies and I just don't like giving spoilers. Just research I'm going to give you like kind of the most backstory as I can. I do encourage people to always research. To always do research here. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to spoon feed to you at all. Uh, With a lot of Hitler's, uh, what, so the generals would end up, you know, after they tried killing Hitler, after, which failed because he lived. The only thing they did was give Hitler splinters in his backside and ruptured eardrums, and that was about it. Uh, and, I uh, know, just made him black and blue all over. That's it. Hit him by a, hit him with a two by four, which was, uh, the table that they were in the bathroom with, uh. Eventually, Hitler's generals would go back to Berlin. Now, the whole Valkyrie thing was to stop, you know, uh, originally was to stop, like, the labels, the slave labels from revolting in Berlin. The generals actually tried to change it, and get, they actually snuck, snuck a copy of it in to actually got Hitler to sign it, which would be changed to have the... In, in, made as an order just in case the SS and Nazi leaders would rise up. So if Hitler died, everyone in the Nazi party, the SS, would be arrested. Rounded up and arrested and know they'd set up a new government. Eventually, you know, the generals realized that the game was up. 
<laughs> yeah, Shaft and Bog was like, it hit those dead. What's all this fax? Eventually, the generals would be killed, but, uh, and this was something that caused Hitler to become still uh, more paranoid than what he was, and more distrusting of not just his generals, not just other people like his anti semitists but also now with his generals. And that would mean that people would, who were generals and military leaders, they had to be around armed guards. None of them could be allowed to bring a briefcase because that's what the bomb was hidden in during this, the Valkyrie South Station attempt. No one could bring a firearm, so everything was made more stricter. And eventually, now as the war would go on, uh, and I would go back, bring back to where we left off in the last video about Anne Frank's family. Even the Russians uh, would come too, too late. Uh, they, even though they liberated, I guess, was it Bogan Belson or whatever, was a Frank and Frank and her sister was. The only person who survived that family was Otto Frank. So it would, they would come too late. Uh, so everyone but Otto Frank would die of all the members of the annex, secret annex. Uh, and eventually, you know, back to what I was saying about you know, how I'm going to bring it over to uh, a lot of the other leaders that Hitler would install uh, in other countries he took over. Who, some of them uh, in the Eastern Front would uh, kind of tell Hitler to get lost and say we're not listening to anymore and Hitler would have them removed. And eventually, you know, the Russians would take over these areas, and he, they would they would kick him out. They would kick his men out. <laughs> and eventually, you no. Know, Hitler would also lose trust of not just also also Mussolini would have him as a puppet leader, and he would lose trust with him. Now Mussolini would eventually be captured by Italian partisans and dragged through the streets and hung upside down by his heels with his mistress. Uh, and eventually, how this would happen around you know, Hitler's you near know, close to the end of his life. Now, back in the Berlin, once the war started really getting closer to the capital of Germany, Hitler would have the Volksmannschaft, which was the People's Militia, uh, which was ill equipped in every possible way. You had senior citizens and young kids fighting a well-trained army for a dumb cause because of the dumb fuel had this, this all or nothing attitude and when they started dying guess what? same as the first same as what I said before Hitler would lose trust and would act just like you expect in every toxic person's life he would be like Germany didn't even dissolve me it's always somebody else's fault. I I know kind of people like that. It's always someone else's fault due to their dumb stupidity. Might I bring up somebody in life? The reason why I'm actually wanting to get a job is because of that one person's life. Blaming everyone except herself for causing her own suspension in practically the month of April all the way to May 1st. <laughs> I'm going to have to, I swear, make a video about that little piece of crud. She's no different than Hitler, in my opinion. She just doesn't commit mass murder and genocide, but still, no different than him. <laughs> But now bring back to Adolf Hitler, because this is a video about Adolf Hitler. Hitler would eventually, you know, realize that the war was lost. You know, at times he'd be like, well, the war is not lost. The war of itself is screwed. I'm going to die. Eventually he would marry his mistress, Ava Braun. Uh, freaking notifications. 
just just always get spammed by this one torch member every time. It's like spamming. It's like the junk mail on Facebook. Every time, so I'm gonna have to try to set my notifications. If there's some way I can do that for like a time limit, great. <laughs> I don't like it. Uh, but no, back to us saying Hitler would marry his mistress. Now Hitler wanted to be seen as a. Oh jeez, thank goodness. Hitler would want to be seen as a as the supreme bachelor. Uh, which is just great, knowing that his only girlfriend or only love life was Germany, even though Hitler had so many other women that uh, ended up all in suicides, including his mistress, Ava Braun. Eventually, they would kill themselves. And Hitler would also have Joseph Goebbels become president. Now, if he want to become pure, so that's the difference between man and high castles, kind of uh, fudging up history was Hitler was the only one who wanted to be the Fuhrer. No one else. There would be German presence before and after him. Chancellors before and after him. He was the one and only Fuhrer. So. so that's what Hitler would do with Goebbels, who eventually would kill himself also because he wanted to die with his supposedly blow with fuel and his wife was just terrible she god awful would kill the kids i hate to leave this lecture series on a terrible note and the horrible stuff it did i mean again i'm going i'm trying to make this as peachy keen and not whitewashed history but also try to follow youtube's little algorithm too that's fun uh, but that's 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 why I want to kind of also get this thing done and so forth. So eventually Hitler would kill himself. Uh, he he would not escape to Argentina. I'm sorry to boast all your little friends of the Hitler escaped to Argentina conspiracy theory. He ended up dying in a bunker, shoot himself in the head. Buying a cyanide capsule, having his mistress die next to him, Ava Braun, his old wife of only practically two days at most. A guy that marries women that, like I said, every relationship ends up in a suicide, just like a bad ex. So this is Lisa Stayed here saying to you, finally we are done with this video series. Make become a subscribe to my YouTube channel of Lisa Stayed and Hitler Obsessed. Like these videos, share, leave a comment, donate to my Patreon, donate to my subscribe store, go to my bitch channel at Lisa Stayed dot Lisa Marie Stay dot com Lisa Marie Stay, that's one one. Go to my Facebook account, Facebook Messenger. At least a stage and me friend request, leave a message, do both. You can uh, definitely uh, go see that one account that I mentioned before the restrict bill. Uh, God forbid if that goes through. Uh, but eventually, no. Uh, you can also go to uh, my Facebook group of Hitler Interested History Buffs. And I'm happy to say. We are finally done with this Dawn series. I don't want to do any more. And if anyone asks me to do any more, I am not going to respond. Did anything else but this guy again. I'm done. I'm over with him. I want to do something else. Anything else but a, more of the documentary on Hitler. Or the Life and Death Hitler series. I'm done with it. I'm finally done. I'm happy. Can you see the tiredness of me? I'm done with it. Yay! Yeah. <laughs>